During your daily routines for records and information management, knowing how to save an email is important. Saving an email as a PDF format is quick and easy to do, even though there's not even a save button. Let's take a look. The big question is, do you need to save an entire email conversation, which could easily be 10 or more emails back and forth with one person, or do you just need to save one individual email? Once that has been decided, there are two different places to click to start the process of saving an email or an email thread. To save the entire email thread or conversation, go to the subject line of the email and click on the printer icon there. Yes, the printer icon. To save an email, we print it. The entire email thread can be seen, printed, or saved. To save an individual email, open the email you want to save, click on the drop down arrow, and choose print. Again, we will print the email to save it. Only the one email is now seen, not the entire thread. Once print has been selected in either place, the print dialog box will open. Just as you can change to a different printer, the destination can be changed also. Saving on Google Drive is an option we will take a look at in a moment. Save as a PDF allows us to choose a location on our computer to save the PDF file. Here you can see which destination is selected. Click Save. The location I chose to save the PDF file to is my desktop. Click to make sure the format selected is Portable Document Format or PDF. Click Save. The file is now on my desktop. Another option to choose for the destination is Save to Google Drive. Click Save. The email will be saved as a PDF file directly to My Drive. From there, you can click and drag it to the desired location. That's the quick process for saving an email. Just remember, when you're looking for that Save button, it's not there. Choose Print as a PDF. Have a great day.